Hi friends and welcome back to the Baseball Card Illustrated channel. I'm Bronco, the PSA 11, and this is Mystery Mondays, the weekly series where you have a chance to win the prize package headlined by the team captain that you select. All you have to do is follow a couple simple rules and you'll be placed on the wheel next week and eligible for a chance to win. First of all, you gotta be a public subscriber to the channel. Second, watch this video and find out who the team captains are and pick one of them and leave a comment by Friday at 11.59 p.m. Central Standard Time with what team captain you want and let us know the mystery word, player name, or phrase that we're gonna mention somewhere in this episode and you will have a chance to win the prize package if the mystery wheel spins in your favor on next week's video and lands on your name. Now, before we get to the matchup between Joey Votto and Chris Bryant that we talked about last week, I want to share a little bit about a special giveaway as part of this week's envelopes. If you go and watch some of Football Week here on the channel we just concluded in appreciation and excitement for week one of the NFL season, we're going to give away not a football card. Rather, we're going to give away this Andre's The Big Cat Galarraga card signed Donruss Optic during his days with Montreal. Clearly not an Expos jersey, just Montreal baseball there. But all you have to do is add to your comment and then win next week, obviously, what the score of my youth football team's game was on Saturday that was mentioned in the Spectacular of Football Card Awesomeness. So go watch the Spectacular of Football Card Awesomeness and then leave a comment on this video right here that you're watching right now by Friday at 11.59 p.m. Central Standard Time and let me know what the score of that game was. And then if you win next week, you'll also get a card of the Big Cat, Andres Galarraga. Also, speaking of football week, we had a lot of fun with the Bishop Sycamore team set. Go check out that video. That was a ton of fun both to put together and there's been some great comments on there. Now, as I put these up here, actually we'll get to the wheel, I'll let you know that the mystery word, player name, or phrase this week is actually part of a story I'm about to tell. So those of you that follow baseball might know that the Milwaukee Brewers threw a no-hitter on Saturday against Cleveland, and it was actually the third no-hitter in franchise history. That's right, a lot of people get this wrong because they, they correctly know that Juan Nieves threw a no-hitter in 1987, but CC Sabathia also threw a no-hitter back in 2008. And the only person who has ever come up with a hit in a Brewers no-hitter is Pittsburgh Pirates official scorer, Bob Webb, who somehow erroneously gave Andy LaRoche a base hit in the fifth inning of a September 1st game that year on a check swing that clearly should have been an error. So the Brewers now have three no-hitters, not two, three with Bob Webb having the only hit in a Brewer no-hitter. So, in your comment on this video to have a chance to win the team captain of your choice, let us know that Bob Webb had a negative influence on Brewer history. So, Bob Webb, leave that in a comment and you'll have a chance to win. Now, let's get to Joey Votto versus Chris Bryant. And as we get the wheel up here, I will let you know that in the running this week are... Flying Dutchman Cards, SW, Michael Myers, Dustin and Blake, Braves Collector, the Jericho 1123, Math Bowler, Joe and Zoe, Joseph Segal, Jason VT Sports Guy, Brandon Stebbins, Diamond Princess, Carolina Hits Cards, Hits Card, try it again, Carolina Hits Cards, Kelly and Jordan Squad, Canadian Card Breakers, Autographs 2000, Poor Man Stack, don't Talk to Robots, Lisa Z, 2011 Card Span, Zach Sports Cards and Collectibles, Reviews, Scott Heitmeyer, hopefully I said that right, Dylan Sally, and Stix G. Now, a couple weeks ago I talked about the importance of being a public subscriber. This is the last week I did go through, and hopefully I got everybody that did leave a comment on this video, or I should say last week's video, and add you to the wheel if you are not a public subscriber. I'm always worried about missing somebody because sometimes things on YouTube and the comment section get a little weird. So again, starting with this video and your chance to win the team captains we're gonna unveil in a minute here, 
you will have to be a public subscriber to the channel or unfortunately we're probably going to miss your comment and i don't want anybody that took the time to do that to miss out on that so the easiest way for us to make sure we have everybody is um to be a public subscriber because all the ones i went through a second time and verified we're on that list and then i got a couple that have not publicly subscribed so please go ahead and do that and then you'll have a chance to win so we got chris bryant we got joey Votto, and we've got a wheel spin here now you might remember that if you said joey Votto is your team captain on this video you're gonna have an extra special card in that envelope based off of something that we did on the Saturday shoot-around prior to that video. So, anyway, it looks like the winner of the prize package of their choice is going to be... I believe this is a new winner. Congratulations to Joe and Zoe. So, I'm pretty sure I do not have any information for you, so if you would leave a comment on this video with either your email address or mailing address, we'll be definitely able to get the prize package out to you that you selected so congratulations and let's put the mystery or i should say the uh backdrop back up and i'll let you know that your team captains real quickly for this week are an autograph card from i'm not even sure what that's from panini origins of mauricio duban from the san francisco giants or a relic card of a guy that I almost saw throw a perfect game in Detroit a few weeks ago, Tristan McKenzie. So leave a comment with the secret word, or I should say mystery word, player name, or phrase, and let us know which of these team captains you would select if the mystery wheel spins in your favor and lands in your name next week. And don't forget, go watch the Spectacular of Football Card Awesomeness and include the score of my team's game from Saturday in your comment that you'll leave by Friday, 11.59 p.m. Central Standard Time, and you'll have a chance to win. So let's go with the Chris Bryant prize package first because that is the one that was not selected by Joe and Zoe. And you'll see right here the Chris Bryant envelope. Blow it into it, Karnak style, as always. And we would have had for you a Todd Helton draft pick card. A Mark McGuire card, because August was Mark McGuire month here on the channel. This lovely Doc Gooden card from 1984 design of Tops. Got an early Kirby Puckett. I think that's a 1986, yep, 1986 Fleer. A Craig Biggio rookie card, and the sweet Bo Jackson. However, that was not the prize package selected, and with good reason, as you'll find out. So we'll put those aside. And we got a little Joey Votto. Now, I'm kind of curious. Does anybody know what his walk-up song is when he plays at his home games at Great American Ballpark? I'll give you a clue. It's a song that I'm a big fan of by a band that I really like. So, along with Joey Votto, we have the captain, Derek Jeter, just inducted into the Hall of Fame. We got a Jim Tomei card from 92 Fleer Ultra. It says it's a rookie card. We got Big Mac, because it's Mark, it was Mark McGuire month here on the channel, along with another Big Mac. So apparently we got a whole lot of first base going on. And this was the reason to pick the Joey Votto prize package, because you've got yourself a Miguel, a Miguel Sano autograph card, numbered to 75 from Topps Museum Collection. So congratulations to... Joe and Zoe, and you can be a winner by entering the contest on next week's video right here on the Baseball Card Illustrated channel. Thank you for watching. On behalf of Kevin the Diamond King, Dylan our graphics guru, and Teddy Bridgewater who led the Broncos to a week one victory. <laughs> Sorry, Jason VT sports guy. I'm Bronco, the PSA 11. So long, everybody. You've been watching the Baseball Card Illustrated channel.